people welcome to my channel my name is Larissa and today I'm gonna show you probably one of my favorite DIYs ah, it's hard to say because I've made so many stuff but like this one it might top it it really might top it it's surprisingly my favorite because first of all I don't like colors you can see by my background the only colorful thing is the thing and it's funny because I saw the branch and I'm like mm, I'm not gonna grab it because I keep grabbing stuff to make something I never make anything so I didn't grab it a week later I saw it again the same spot and I'm like mm, I should get it and then I didn't and then I was coming back from the dentist I remember because I could not feel my face and I was like you know what I'm gonna grab this and it was rainy I parked grabbed the thing put it on the truck and people were looking at me like what's going on crazy lady but it was worth it because i freaking love how it turned out i feel like it looks like i literally bought at a store so i love how it looks and i want to show you how i made it because it's super simple and if you ever find one of these branches laying around somewhere grab it grab it because it's gonna look amazing especially now summer spring oh so without further ado i'm gonna show you how i made it but if you do like this video please give this video a thumbs up leave your comment i always answer to all your comments and i love seeing you interact because i feel like i'm not talking to just a camera i'm talking to someone you know so let me know how you like the video how you like the diy and if you want to see a specific video next let me know because i can make that happen and yes let's go into it so here's my branch in all its glory in my very massive backyard long story short a tree fell in my garage and they had to basically rebuild it but anyways that's not the point the first thing i did was clean it up a little bit because i did not want all those flaky things falling all inside my house and also maybe if there was any bug i also didn't want that inside my house so i just used the brush and just brushed the whole thing off then i took it inside i actually didn't need any of those tools that i had there it was just in case so here i was just trying to have it as straight as possible so i could visualize where i wanted to put each of the flowers so that they would look all spread out and for that i used some bricks and also some grocery bags just so it wouldn't be moving around whenever i was placing the flowers talking about flowers i was in between all those options and i'm actually so glad i went with the pink because i just love the contrast and it is a pop of color that i definitely did not have in my house and those two different ones were just in case i wanted to add some different ones which i did add the right one so i just removed all the flowers from the stem including those flowers that are not quite open yet on the top and i'ma tell you at first i was scared i was wearing gloves because i always managed to get some piece of wood inside my skin inside my hands inside everything but i didn't realize like i literally just had to place the flower on the branch nothing else like occasionally i needed to cut the branch a little bit just so that the flower would fit but that was it then after i was happy with how it was looking i grabbed this dollar tree planter that has just been lying around on my patio i don't even know why i bought it but anyways i found a solution for it i sealed the little holes just using hot glue just use a lot of it and it will be as sealed as possible and since my backyard is a construction site i grabbed a bunch of those rocks because they broke everything out there and i just placed them into the planter trying to save on concrete here <laughs> I'm laughing but it's real I had to make it three times because I thought it was enough and then for some reason concrete will always just disappear anyways after it was finally done and it took my whole thing of concrete cement whatever that was I put those bricks on top of it just so it would hold the stick not stick the branch in place and then let it dry overnight and then the next day when i was a hundred percent sure i had the flowers exactly where i wanted them to be i just hot glued them to the branch and i'm not sure why but i only filmed this on vertical so this is the only footage i have of that but then after i was done with that i just placed this moss sheet that i got on clearance like i don't know two years ago and i just think it took it from a five to a ten just kidding 
it was a nine and a half before the mouse and this is how it turned out i love it so much as i say it looks delicious and that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed the diy in the video if you did enjoy make sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any other diys that i make and if you like to see behind the scenes and just smaller projects make sure to follow me on instagram and tiktok so you can watch it all thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video